My name is Gergan Tsenov and I'm the founder and the music director of Tsenov Chamber Ensemble. I come from Bulgaria where I first studied orchestral and opera conducting at the National Academy of Music in Sofia. In 1999 I moved to the United States where I continued my conducting studies at the Juilliard School. My most recent appointment was as a principal conductor of the New Amsterdam Symphony Orchestra in New York. My name is Tina Gonzalez and I'm the administrative director of Tsenov Chamber Ensemble. I'm also the director of financial aid at the Juilliard School, which is where I met Gergan, and we've been friends ever since. I'm also a musician with a degree in vocal performance from the Boston Conservatory, and currently I'm a member of the Oratorial Society of New York. Tsenov Chamber Ensemble is a group of extraordinary young musicians, brought together by a very unique mission, to bring to the New York concert stage the hidden treasures of an entire musical culture that, for political or other reasons, has been kept away from the world for decades. I'm speaking about the classical music of Bulgaria. Coming to New York City was, of course, a turning point in my life. Uh, first, because I had the opportunity to study at the Juilliard School, where I met and worked with some truly brilliant young musicians. But more importantly, because of the incredible chance to meet and work with people whom I had expected to see, believe me, only in my dreams. New York is a giant melting pot, where cultures and ideas from all over the world mix and make this gigantic and very colorful puzzle. Uh, well, it didn't take me too long to realize that one of the most underrepresented European cultures in this puzzle was the culture of my own country, Bulgaria. And by putting these three things together, New York with its hunger for everything that is new, my brilliant fellow musicians, and the music of generations of Bulgarian composers, I came to the idea of establishing Tsenov Chamber Ensemble. When Gergan asked me to help get the Tsenov Chamber Ensemble off the ground, I was very honored, but also very nervous. Starting an arts organization is an enormous undertaking, and there's a lot of work to be done. But it's so exciting to be a part of this discovery and to have the opportunity to learn more about this culture that I admire so much. I've met quite a few Bulgarian musicians at Juilliard, and I've always been impressed by the way they put their heart and soul into everything they do especially when playing the music of their own country. So I'm really looking forward to this wonderful collaboration. Musicians around the world lament about music facing a sort of a dead end. And I think that it is simply not fair to speak of a dead end if the music of composers such as Konstantin Iliev, Lazar Nikolov, Ivan Spasov, Vasil Kazanjiv, Georgi Tutev, Semyon Pironkov, to name only few names, is absolutely unknown to the audiences around the world. Participating in our project are colleagues of mine with whom I have already performed many times and whom I know, so to speak, firsthand. Uh, they are all highly devoted to our mission and they are all very excited to be part of Tsenov Chamber Ensemble. Tsenov Chamber Ensemble will have its inaugural concert on May 29, 2015, in the very heart of New York City at the Bruno Walter Auditorium in Lincoln Center. Through your generous support and through your love of classical music, the American public will have the chance to hear music that has never been performed in this country before. Tsenov Chamber Ensemble is a project of discovery, a project of challenge and a project of enrichment. With your help and encouragement, our orchestra will ensure that there are fewer dead ends and more open roads in the world of contemporary classical music. <laughs>